Have you ever heard someone say, whatever floats your boat? Well, the answer should always be buoyancy. Buoyant force is the force applied upward on an object by any fluid. Archimedes' principle states that the buoyant force applied to an object is equal to the weight of the fluid the object displaces. Let's take a closer look at this definition. First, we need to understand displacement. As the story goes, Archimedes poured himself a warm bath one day, and when he got in, he realized the level of the water went up. He then determined that the more of his body he put in the bath, the higher the water level went. This means the volume of his body that he put in the water had to move or displace the water so he could fit in the bath. Therefore, displacement in this context is when an object moves a fluid so it can occupy the volume the fluid originally occupied. Let's use a battleship as an example. A battleship is made of steel. Right about now, you may be saying, but steel doesn't float. So how is it a battleship can float? Look at the image of the battleship. Now imagine drawing a line where the water comes up on the hull of the ship, then fill the ship's hull with water up to that line. How much do you think the water would weigh? If you said a lot, you're right. It would actually weigh as much as the entire ship. The weight of the water to fill up the hull of the ship weighs the same as the ship. So the water applies a buoyant force up on the ship with this much force. Therefore, the ship made of steel floats. Let's